we have created the products table now we will write the query to insert the product inside the database to insert the data inside the database to form we have to modify something i will show you inside index.php first from our previous session we have included this connect i will remove this one inside this form we will be passing method attribute and inside this i will be giving post post method get method we are not going to use because if we insert the data all the data will be displayed inside the url so we are going to use post method and also you can see we are going to insert the images as well so to insert any kind of images we are going to write here ink type this attribute will allow us to insert the images inside the database inside this i will be giving this value this value will be same throughout multi part form data i will remove this equal to this is the value we are going to pass inside this n type multi part form data now for this input field image where we are inserting the image i don't want user should insert svg files so what i will be doing i will be giving one attribute and inside this i will give this image and this has to accept png images whichever i insert then image it should accept jpg images and also i just want to accept image jpeg jpeg only these three extension images i want to accept when i insert the data inside the database png jpg and jpeg first i have added this attribute then this attribute n type to insert the images inside the database and finally we have just added this accept attribute which will be accepting all these three extension now if we want to insert the data inside the database inside input fields there is one important attribute that is name attribute for each and every input field for text i will be adding name and inside this i am just going to give product name these these values are very very important for price i will write name and here inside this i will be writing product price i will copy the same thing i will paste it here for image i will just write here product image these attributes are very important without this attribute we will not be able to insert any data inside the database and at the end for this input field name and here i will write at product for product name we have added for product price for product image and finally for the button why i have given this for button because whenever i click on this button when this attribute is active only then i want to insert all the data we have done this modification to our form next we are going to start writing our insert query